Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So, sorry I'm getting this to you guys a little bit late. Uh, I've just been enjoying myself. Since I've switched over to just doing milestones, I have more time to do other stuff. So I've been working on some other things that uh, I've been putting off. Uh, worked on a few videos. And uh, as you can see, I've even done the uh, T1 Alpha. Still got plenty of time left. So I'm just enjoying it. Anyway, we've got a new champion, uh, Rintra, I think is how you say his name, uh, Minotaur. And we've got Void in the basic. So we're going to take a look at the leaderboards and we're going to see if we recognize any names, give any shout outs, that sort of thing. All right. So let's go ahead over here and let's go over to the basic first. And I have Void as a six star. I could have gone for the awakening because he really needs the awakening. I don't blame anybody for going for uh, Void to awaken him in the basic. I just didn't want to do that. It would save me an awakening gem, but uh, I can wait until uh, I get him naturally duped. I don't use him that much, and I'm still a little salty. Back when I was really hunting for him, couldn't pull him. All right, Matthew, number 23. Nice, nice. <clears throat> By the time I got Void... I had already used, uh, ooh, the Parasite, 29, nice. Uh, was that a first time or a dupe? But anyway, um, by the time I got him, I had waited so long that I ended up using an Awakening Gem on uh, Captain America Infinity War and took him straight to 200 sig. Uh, that was as a five star. So... I got him eventually. By the time I did, I really didn't even need him. I used Captain America Infinity War for the things that I was planning to use Void for. So, uh, not, not, not into Void anymore like I was. Because I really wanted him before. But time kept moving on. So now, if I awaken him, he would be one that I would love to have duped. He really does need that awakening, uh, in my opinion. So definitely worth using a gem on. I don't know if I'd use a generic on him uh, at this point in time. But definitely one that I would like awakened, even at uh, SIG 20. He's one that every single SIG level that you give him, he's worth it. All right, I, I don't know if I missed anybody. Apologies if I did. I'm trying to see here. Yeah, apologies if I did. It's starting to get a little bit late. And I want to make one more video tonight. Uh, although I might end up doing it tomorrow morning. We'll see. We'll see what happens. I um, already made... Uh, two videos, and then this one's a third one for today. All right, there we go. So, Genko, you are the last one uh, to get a six-star void. How does it feel? Uh, but let's take a look and see who has that coveted, not coveted, uh, <laughs> position 101. Yeah. Galen de la Verdad. I'm sorry that you were 101. No one wants to be 101, but someone is always 101. Oh man, I know you guys were going for Void. Everybody I see right there, you had to have been going for Void. Mm, free Tom Brady. Okay. I'm out of it, so I'm not even aware of anything concerning Tom Brady. So don't look at me. All right, let's see who else. These are folks, maybe they never got a, a five-star void or they're going for the awakening. Like I said, he's worth it. Even, even SIG level one, 
is worth it. I just didn't feel like grinding for him. I have no idea yet what the cutoff is. I haven't seen anyone posting anything yet. So I know if I could, if, if it was possible for me to get some insider information on the cutoff, I would definitely include those in my videos. That would be really nice if there was something Kabam could do. Hmm. You know, I might ask and see if that's possible. Uh, Kabam Zero does a lot of quality of life improvements to the game. Maybe I'll ask him. You know, <clears throat> maybe, um, you know, it's not that difficult. Or maybe when they're doing the calculations of the rankings and everything, because they have that information. So maybe they could publish it somewhere, you know, like, you know, once, once we see the cutoff, they know how much that person put up, but maybe there's some other issues with that. Maybe some privacy issues, something like that. I don't know, but anyway, so that was it for there. Let's look at Rintra. That's the featured He's the new champion. Um, <clears throat> this arena, as far as I'm concerned, is broken. But those scores up there, one, two, and three, they probably put up like 200 plus million. Okay, just so you know. And uh, this, this one, it seems like the new champions are going for like 180 and up. So that's kind of if you're if you are someone who is planning to go for a six star in the featured, I recommend that you do it round two. So you have an idea of what they're going for. And then make your plans. But if you are going to go for round one, you know, maybe you don't have a choice. Maybe you work and you're not able to do it round two, which is during the week the work week, then <clears throat> what I would suggest, uh, if you're gonna do it, <clears throat> start aiming for uh, 190, 200, because it's that broken. If it's a new champion, that is. New champion. But yeah, as for me, and my house, my fingers, yeah, we're not doing that. Now, round two, I'll probably go for the five star. Um, I do have some things that uh, I need to do. Yeah, there's the grumpy goat. Um, I do have uh, an appointment, I think, this Tuesday. So what I'm going to try and do is uh, grind <clears throat> early on Tuesday. You know, maybe Tuesday morning I can do it. Uh, time to shine. I see you. Congratulations, man. 79. What score did you put up? You're at least closer down to the cutoff. So uh, that'll be a good idea. Um, give people a good idea of the scores, what they're looking like up there. Uh, so definitely leave a, a comment. All right. But yeah, I'm going to... Oops, I just went all the way past it. That should tell you something. I'm just, I started zoning out. Uh, but 101, A kick. Is that how you say that? Is that what that reads? My eyes are doing funny things right now. And that is not helping. Uh, but anyway, 101, sorry to see it so close and yet so far. Okay, let's see what else. I'm also trying to make plans. Mm, plan B1, okay. Um, <clears throat> didn't plan that, but I'm uh, trying to make plans for the grind, even though it's just a five-star. Um, for my roster, that's not bad, but I have to be careful and still schedule since I know I'm going to have uh, to take, I know my sister to... Oh, I forgot where I got to take her. I'll find out. Um, but it's a good ways away. 
which means I'll be sitting in the car for a while while she has her appointment. So I have to be prepared. You know, if I do any grinding, uh, I'll try to do the grinding earlier in that day. Uh, so we'll, we'll see. We'll see. Like I said, it's just a five star. Usually the five stars I can do just with my six stars. So because I'm also just doing milestones, um, the way it'll go, Black Gamer, I see you. Uh, the way it'll go is Monday, I'll knock out all the milestones for the basic arena. Uh, I'll run all of my six stars in the featured. I'll run my five stars. Not all of them, just, you know, probably my maxed out ones. And then that's it. Now, I might Tuesday morning run more of my five stars, run all of my six stars, hopefully early enough that um, I don't have to worry about it while I'm taking her, that it doesn't interrupt that grind. So just got to plan it out. Just got to plan it out. But, um, and that's why I always tell them, just let me know, you know, so that I can plan. Uh, but anyway, that's going to do it. Uh, thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.